Could hearing aids save your brain? After my dad was diagnosed with Alzheimer's disease, I dove deep into all of the potential causes that the research showed. One I hadn't considered very important until that moment was my dad's terrible hearing. It was actually a bit of a family joke that we could talk smack about my dad in the same room as him and he would never know it. Now, he, like a lot of people, didn't want to get hearing aids, and when he finally did get them, he never wanted to wear them. Unfortunately, the longer that you go without hearing well, the more that your brain stops transmitting those auditory signals. This lack of brain stimulation is actually harmful in three different ways. First, the areas of your brain that deal with hearing actually shrink. Second, when you can't hear well, you also begin to isolate yourself socially and you lose the stimulation from those parts of your brain as well. Third, both hearing loss and social isolation contribute to risk for depression, which actually increases cognitive decline even more. Please, if you or somebody you know is experiencing hearing loss, don't put off getting hearing aids.